Okay, so let's change our code now to take advantage of some of the Terraform 0.12 features. If we actually Google uh, Terraform 0.12, we could find the original preview post and we could see just some of the features that are coming since obviously the docs aren't updated yet. Um, and let's just go through and like see if we can make these changes anywhere. So first class impressions, let's start, let's start with that. Um, this is going to let us change from this dollar sign syntax to just referencing them directly when we use them on their own. And I think we can make good use of that. So let's start by making those changes. Um, and let's start just in this big SES folder. And sorry, I don't have better syntax highlighting. It's kind of ugly. Um, but for example, here's some crazy stuff up here that is doing nothing. So if we just get rid of it, that should just work. Right, let's just get rid of all this. Get rid of all of this. Okay, and let's just like keep it small and let's see if that works. So we'll run a plan. It parses, so we don't get a parse error. So I think this is gonna be just fine. I'll turn refresh off in future, future ones. And there's no changes, so totally worked. That is already just a lot cleaner. Um, I already noticed that this is kind of ugly, so we're using the elements trick uh, to access a dynamic list, which uh, you had to do in 0 0.11, and I don't think you have to do that in 0 0.12. I think you could actually just change that to this. Um, so let's do that next. It parses again. Oh, I told you to refresh off, and I forgot. Next time. And again, that works, so let me just put that in my history so I don't forget. Um, so much nicer. So let's see where else, I mean here, we could get rid of this. We could get rid of this. Get rid of this. I won't get rid of all of them. I mean, I don't think you need to watch me get rid of all of them. Um, but let's get rid of a bunch of them. Just so much cleaner. Um, I guess we could just do a search for like this. Yeah, this is really nice. Okay, so this is some crazy stuff going on here. What's what is happening here? Oh, this actually needed it because we are interpolating here. This one doesn't, so Okay, so here's like a good example of something crazy. Let me again make sure this is all like working just fine. Cool. Uh, this is for formatting something, but there's also this element here with the dynamic count index. And now what we should be able to do is actually just do this. And that's it. Like you would expect if you're familiar with programming. And it works. So that is really nice so much cleaner um, i'll stop there for right now for this change and let's see what else we could do let's see what are expressions with lists of maps just to make sure yeah we don't do any of that all right so let's call that good uh, next we can do four expressions i don't think i use any of these well, let me just see, because if I could, that would be really cool. Um, no, I don't think I'd do any like crazy stuff anywhere that would benefit from that. Because I don't have any lists anywhere. Just jumping around, so. Nah, uh, for loops are really cool. I wish I could use these and show you what they look like, but um, I don't really have a use for them. So let's go ahead and skip that. I don't think we need this either. We don't use any dynamic stuff. Okay. Uh, we don't use conditionals. Um, actually, I know one thing I'm just remembering. So we have this depends on. These used to be strings. They can now just be like direct references to the thing. And that should work. And it does. Um, and instead of going through the blog post now, I'm just gonna kind of go through this and be like, what? is ugly to me, like what could look better? And how do I make it look better? Actually this on its own, I missed it earlier, but this should just be this, it'll be a lot clearer. Okay, that's cool. I'm 
these were, you know, I could change these, but they're nothing new. You've seen that. So I'll leave them as is. I think the breast is actually pretty straightforward. It is. Um, so there's not much to do here. I want to kind of look at what are this, what's this temp? I don't think I need this template syntax. Yeah, I don't need this, but it's cool. It's very cool. Okay, so I'm looking back at this for, and I think I do have a use case for this. I've never tested for each, so I don't even know if this works, but I have this resource up here, this Cloudflare record, and I'm creating three, but I'm only creating three because I'm actually just looping over the DKIM tokens. So I think in theory, what I could actually do here is do a for each uh, of over the DKM tokens. So there we go. We create for each over those. I could delete count. And I think what I could change with all these is actually each dot value. I think that's what it said here. Each dot key, I don't need each dot value. Um, okay. That is cool if that works. So 4-H doesn't work yet. Fair enough. <laughs> That's, I think, coming very soon. But either way, I could undo all that, and everything still works. So you can look forward to that. Um, that's reserved, and it will work, but not quite yet. And so that's about it. I mean, I already, I mean, all this stuff could be a lot cleaner, right? There's a lot of stuff here that could just be direct access. This, you know, basic example, this could be like this and, and it would still work, um, which is really cool. Uh, and then the last thing I'm gonna do after all this is actually just destroy it. So destroy in past um, versions had some issues. So I'm just curious to see if alpha four fixes them. In the last alpha, my destroys didn't work. Um, but it looks like this is good. Again, you can see some of the cool new plan output here. And let's just destroy it all. And it looks like it worked. So Alpha 4 is looking really good. Um, actually, I'm on Master, so this is almost like a slightly bugs fixed past Alpha 4 version. Is looking really good. Uh, there's a lot of awesome features that we could start using right away. It's cool that there's so few changes necessary to get it working. Um, again, just one character change after changing it and the apply just worked with my 0 0.11 code. Uh, and then I can just go in and incrementally make things better. Um, this is looking really good. I'm so excited for .12 and I uh, hope you are too.